So guys, I'm using Windows 10, but this also works on Windows 11. So once you're on this screen, you wanna click on the power button, and then you wanna hold the shift key. So hold the shift key on your keyboard, and then you wanna click on restart. Keep on holding the shift key. And then you will see a black screen, and then it will take you into this, which is the Windows recovery mode. Now once you're on this screen, we're gonna click on troubleshoot, then we're gonna click on advanced options. Then you wanna click on system image recovery. If you do not see system image recovery, there should be an option around here that says see more recovery options. You wanna click on that, then it should show you system image recovery. You wanna click on it. Click on cancel, and then click on next, and then click on advanced. Then you wanna click on install the driver, and then click on okay. Now once you're on this, we're gonna click on this PC, then you wanna to go to the drive where you have Windows installed on. For you, it's most likely gonna be in your C drive, but for me, it's on my E drive. But for you, it's probably on your C drive. Now, once you're in this, you wanna click on Windows, then you wanna scroll down, and then click on System32. Now, there's a lot of files in this folder, but we want to look for Util Man. So just click on any folder one time, then click on U. Now you wanna scroll down, all the way till you find Util Man. You could just use this to scroll down for it. Now here's Util Man. Now once you find Util Man, you want to right click on it and then click on Rename. Then you want to type in Util Man 12. So just add the number 12 at the end, click on Enter. It hasn't changed here, but it's been saved. So just know that you saved it. Now for the next step, we need to rename the file CMD. So you want to scroll up to the very top and then you want to look for CMD. Just click on any file, then click on C on your keyboard and just scroll down. until you find CMD. You want to right click on it, click on rename, then you want to rename CMD as Util Man, and then click on enter. Again, it's been renamed to Util Man, but it's just a CMD, but it's been saved, but it's been saved as Util Man. Now once you've done that, we're gonna click on cancel, cancel all of this, and then we're just gonna click on continue. Now once you're on this screen, you wanna click on the symbol which will be in the middle. So for Windows 11, it should say accessibility, and for Windows 10, it should say ease of access. Click on it which will then bring up the command prompt. Now once you're on this, we're gonna type in control space user passwords two and click on enter. And then this should come up. Now once you're in this, you wanna find the account that you wanna change the password for. You wanna make sure that it's highlighted and then click on reset password. Now you can either leave this blank for no password or you could just type in your new password that you want. Click on okay, click on okay again. And now you could just sign in with your new password. And that's how you do it.